Welcome back everybody to another package opening. Today we've got some awesome, exciting Force of Will stuff coming your way. Just recently, Jeremy from Ruler School had a big, huge Ruler Festival for Force of Will with tournaments and all sorts of awesome stuff. From everything I hear, the event went super great. I unfortunately wasn't able to attend. Sadly, I was planning on going, especially to get one of their premium packages with a bunch of awesome promos, some gold Ubers and stuff like that. I was very excited to see all the cool stuff I might be able to find at there and play in the tournaments and see what kind of prizes I could win. But since I couldn't make it, I kind of missed out on the opportunity or so I thought. Jeremy hit me up a few weeks later and told me that he had a bunch of the extra promos and things, and if I wanted them, I could purchase some of them since I wasn't able to come to the festival, which I gladly said, hell yes, thank you very much. I would love to get some of those promos. I am always looking for Force of Will promos that I just don't have. A lot of these are like the newer ones from the past few months of like different Grand Prix, world promos, stuff like that, and a few little extra goodies tossed in there from what I'm hearing. So what I ended up doing was still purchasing a ticket for the Ruler Festival for the nice gold package that came with all the nice stuff. So I just got it in the mail today and I'm very excited to check out all the cool stuff that we have going on in this package. Should be some awesome promos and I feel some bendiness here. So maybe a play mat or something, we'll have to see. So again, big shout out to Ruler School. Thank you very much. If you guys don't know already, Ruler School is a big Force of Will channel. They'll teach you how to play Force of Will, tell you all about the game, what the meta's at, different decks, all the sorts of things that you need to know to get playing into Force of Will. Jeremy's got it covered. He does an amazing job. So thank you again and make sure to go hit him up, subscribe to his channel and support him as well. All right, let's open this up. All right, let's see what's going on in this thing. Now, yeah, I do feel a play mat. So I guess I'm gonna slide that out first because it's taking up most of the package here. So, oh, there's some cards falling out. Oh, let's not reveal everything right away. All right, that's it. Just this stack of cards here that we'll look at in a second. And we've got, oh, one of my favorite play mats. Oh, heck yes. I love this one, Magic Stone War Zero. This awesome Lovecraftian play mat. This thing is so sick. I love this thing. I'll never be mad when I have this thing out. It looks amazing. Awesome little extra throw in there. And then we've got the very exciting stack of cards. So we 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 already saw it. So we we we're seeing the first Uber Rare that we got here. That's fine. We need to get this open first. It's packaged very well. Okay, we've got them all out. We're seeing a lot of glint. So we're just gonna go through and check these things out. We got first up Millennia Prince of the Light Palace and Uber Rare. This is a world promo. Very, very cool. Try to flip without giving out too much details on the next card, but Voice of a New Generation. This is absolutely stunning and awesome looking Uber Rare. And I love the ones that have those streaks of color in them. They just look so, so cool. This has gotta be like, I think this is the first one I have like this. I haven't been able to get my hands on any other of these promo Uber Rares. So this is really cool to have in the collection now. I'll gladly add it in with some of the other stuff I have. And we've got some really awesome Japanese magic stones, these full art magic stones. Really, really freaking sweet. So, so cool. I love that foiling too. Bang, that thing is wild and very cool. We might have a couple, I'm not sure. Ooh, we get another Japanese one. Very nice, look at this. Oh, ooh, I see something behind it that I definitely wanna check out. Uh, I wanna flip this over. I don't know how to reveal it without I guess we'll go like this. There we go. We'll do, now oh, we kind of revealed it anyways, but there we go. <laughs> Narl at the tap, looking super sick. Once again, very, very, very cool. Time Spinning Witch in the Japan. Very cool with that, oh, the coloring. The coloring of that purple and red eyes. So neat. All right, let's look at this gold one. Oh, oh, okay, is it? Oh, is this, oh, okay, there's more than one gold. Hold on, let's look at this, let's look at this. Force of Will Fest 2022. Oh my gosh, they had their own little card. So this was the Force of Will Fest card. Wow, they've got like the full text and everything. That is so neat. That's like one of a kind right there. That is super cool. I didn't think that like they, they got all the text and every. That's like legit and official. That is really, really awesome. Wow, that looks really sweet. All right, what's the next one and which way are we we're going? We got to flip it back around. We got a nice gold, gold Uber promo. Let's see it. Holy cow, Brunhild. Oh my gosh, Caller of Spirits. Wow, look at that. You can see it from here, but as soon as you turn it, it all just disappears into this gold blaze. Holy frick, that is amazing. Again, just kind of like these, uh, these promo Ubers. 
I have been dying to get my hands on one of these gold ones. They look absolutely incredible. And this is no exception. This looks so, so cool. Holy crap. All right, let's flip it. Let's take a look. We just got an Uber Rare on this side of Brunhild, basically just the black and white version. And then we flip it to that beautiful gold. So, or I guess it is kind of like a silver. It is kind of like a silver sheen to it. That's really neat. And then it flips to the gold. That is spectacular. I love that so much. That looks so cool. Next up, we've got a promo card of Evil Elemental Uprising. Very, very nice. I got this promo with my box of the Underworld of Secrets. So a couple of these promos I know I got from, you know, Odyssey Games hooking me up. But, you know, Jeremy was going to send these to me first. So these are the first copies I actually was getting of these promos. So I'll give him the credit to that. Odyssey kind of just threw in those other ones, which... I'm not going to be mad at, not, you know, not whatsoever. It's fine. <laughs> I'll take all the extra promos. It's all good. Magic Stone of Knowledge. Really, really dope. That looks beautiful. It's like a Jade Emerald. That's super sweet. Again, same thing with this one. I knew I was going to get this card uh, from Jeremy and then <laughs> Odyssey sent me one as well. But this is a really beautiful card. So I'm never going to complain about having doubles of that one. Ooh, yes. Dagra Magra. That one is a sick full art Oh my gosh, a nice promo again. This is amazing. This is from, I believe this is a league promo, I want to say. But really, really fire. Really cool card. I love Narl at the top. She's such a cool character. Oh yes. Ah, oh, yes, dude. This one's so sick. Pandora, Queen of Miracles. Holy crap, is this card so cool. Just look at how awesome that artwork is. We'll have hope. We got the world. It is a world, right? World promo, yep very very nice a really beautiful card and uh it's it's got some value on it as well so i haven't been able to pick it up personally so by bu buying this little ticket to the force will fest that i wasn't able to attend he actually was able to hook me up with one so i'm very appreciative of that one because that one is just spectacular we've got final reflect final no final breeze final breeze a nice full art final breeze that is really cool i love the swoop on that that's really sharp time spinning witch very nice j ruler that i don't have so that is phenomenal i do not have time spinning witch one there she is right there bang looking amazing and then the best part of this card if you don't know now you do kabang into unbound princess of time kaiguya very incredibly beautiful i wish there was a way to display it open like this they're just there really isn't i don't know it doesn't fit into like any binder or anything when you get to open it up but this is so dope that's such a beautiful card too and one i definitely wanted oh man time spinning witch i do have another box of time spinning witch and part of me wanted to open just for this card so maybe i can keep that one sealed now i don't know but that is a super super cool one so let's see what we got next i'm just like throwing stuff everywhere on the table here we can't read this one because the text is hard to read. Uh, Academy Guard of Lycaon. Lycaon, another league promo. Very sharp, very sharp. Behind it. Oh, I love Yadrazil. I love this card so much, dude. This is such a nice one. I do have this one. It is incredible, though. Such an awesome variation. It's just basically a color variation on the regular version of this card. And it just works so well. This, this like hue of pink is just so phenomenal and again the holographic on this one is just beautiful and you guys know i'm a huge fan of this artist it just does a phenomenal job on all these cards that she does or he does i don't know if it's a man or woman who draws those up next we got the witch of the quenched fire again some epic 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 promos here some epic league promos this is just phenomenal a really really sharp one i love the look of this card i mean come on right so much detail going on in the face and everything and all the armor and stuff. Really, really amazing. Oh, heck yes. I've been eyeing this card, man. Look of corruption. I didn't know I'd be getting this one. As you guys know, I mean, the Valhalla sets, they're my bread and butter. Like I love opening the Valhalla sets and I've opened up a lot of New Dawn Rises. So I have a ton of full art look of corruptions from that set and opening numerous, numerous boxes. Uh, so to have another look of corruption, you'd think would annoy me, but this is a brand new promo, uh, alternate art promo for look of corruption, and it looks sick. Such a nice looking card, and I'm happy to have it to add to my look of corruptions, my like 
oh, I don't even know, like 15 full art look of corruptions. It's ridiculous. Lapis Dark Storm is the next one up here. Wow. Is this a world? This is a World League one. Very cool. Very, very neat. I've never seen this one before, actually. So that one is really cool. And we got another flip flop here. We've got Flame of the Outer World. Dope one. This is, a, I believe this is an older promo from a few years ago. What, do we have a date on here? I'm not sure if that's the year or not. I see like 10 and 9 and stuff, and I see 23 on this, but I'm not sure if it's representative of the year for this one. But I know this is an older promo and a sick one at that. I've got a bunch of the normal versions of that card. And this, we've got Argonite, the Nitron Blade. Again, another card that I didn't know I was going to get. I didn't even know this one existed, honestly. But this card is a card from New Dawn Rises. I've got a bunch of these as well. <laughs> but this is once again like Look of Corruption, a nice alternate promo card. And that looks fire. Oh my gosh, they like tricked out that sword, man. That thing is bonkers. Really dope. So two cards, two nice promo cards from New Dawn Rises to add to the collection, the growing collection of New Dawn stuff. Hey, <laughs> Valkyrie of Mercy, my third copy now because Odyssey Games sent me one of these as well, which is so funny. But one of my favorites out of the Valkyries is this one. So again, no complaints here from me whatsoever. I do not care because they just look super, super good. And yeah, it's just such a pretty card. I love it. Last one, I think. Is this the last one? We got the final stance, the final stance, the final stance looking sick what does this one say on it rl21 so this should just be a league promo the final stance i believe i remember seeing this one not too long ago so it's a relatively recent maybe the last year or two uh with maybe the last cluster can't remember though shoot but super dope man that looks really really sick awesome card wow there is so so much here so many cards that i gotta get sleeved up and put away into some top loaders and stuff especially man oh man this gold, oh, I cannot wait to put that into my J-Ruler binder. I can't wait to put this one in my J-Ruler binder. Someone tell me, how do you guys, how do you guys store these? Do you guys ever try to like double sleeve these and like showcase them in a binder or something? I would love to, man, but it's just, it seems almost impossible. But man, I love this card. I love to get uh, this one into a sleeve really quick here too, because that is just beautiful as well. So, so cool. Very happy. I wish I could have made it to the Force of Will Fest, but this was nice to get this little package. I appreciate the hookup again, Jeremy. Thank you. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. And if you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more of the package unboxings and TCG unboxings and all the other stuff we're doing on the channel. Another thank you to Jeremy. I appreciate the hookup with all this stuff. It was awesome. Once again, go subscribe to his channel as well. The link will be in the description. Guys, have a great rest of your week. Whenever this comes out, look for more unboxings soon and we'll see you in the next one.